Hey guys, it's me, Zadora. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are back with another cash stuffing video. So today we're going to be cash stuffing our first paycheck of May. It is May the 11th. And I have went to the bank to get some cash out. And some of this cash also came from one of my sinking funds, the vacation sinking fund. But I did go and pull $286 out of the bank. These little cute slips, they're post-it notes. Super cute. I got these from Salisa over at Beautifully Me and You. Um, I like these versus the other ones. I'll still probably, you know switch between them both but because i don't have to clean these off every time i have to go to the bank i can just toss it so it's convenient that way but the other ones are more efficient that i can just keep reusing them over and over but i did like using this today <laughs> and the bank teller said they were really cute so i got that there and then i have 75 that i pulled from my singing funds my numbers are going to be a little off because after I left the bank, I had to go get gas because your girl gas like came on. And so, yeah, <laughs> let's go ahead and count the money. And you see we got that 50 at the top. So we're not even finna uh, play with that. So we got 50, <laughs> 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 120, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 dollars. That's a lot of dollar bills. So we have 341 dollars that's going to go into our cash wallet, sinking funds, and savings challenges this week. All right, so first things first, I'm going to go ahead and unstuff my wallet. And we do have some rollover, which I love because you know it goes into our savings challenges. Letter has nothing. Eating out has $11 left. Okay. Grocery has a lot of ones. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ones left in groceries. Gas had 10. And I know y'all probably thinking, girl, why didn't you just put the $10 in there? Because I knew <laughs> I knew I was getting paid and I wanted this $10 to be able to make it towards my singing funds. And so that's why I did that. <laughs> and then miscellaneous has $11 left. So total and rollover, we have 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40 dollars. That is amazing. So, so amazing. So, so great. What do you guys do with your rollover cash? I know some of y'all put it into like, um, your saving challenges. Some of some people leave their rollover in their wallet, which I think is good in some aspects. If you know you have like a short week coming up and you're gonna need that extra cushion, I can see that. But I just like mine to go towards some of my savings challenges. I think it gives it a little boost. <laughs> um, so this week and Letta is getting $10. Eating out is getting $15, That's a 10 and a five. Groceries is getting $50, and I guess decided to do 150 this time. Gas was supposed to get $50, but I already put $20 in my tank, so it's just gonna get the remaining 30. And then miscellaneous is getting $5. So that is it for my cash wallet. I'm still loving the little tabs. I am thinking also about switching wallets. I know 
<laughs> well, not switching wallets, switching back to my smaller LD one. I don't know what it's called. Y'all know what I'm, what I'm talking about, though. Um, I just want to find some cute dashboards. Like, I think it's the A7 wallet. So if you guys, if you guys know someone who makes some cute A7 dashboards, please link it down low in the comment section. I asked on Instagram, but literally nobody responded to my post. I was like, dang. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and get into our sinking funds this week. Letta is getting $5, and surprisingly, I still have five left in there. So that makes $10, $10, $10 in Letta. <laughs> And I did change the order of some of my envelopes as well. Um, vacation. I took out 75. Update. <laughs> Still going on a missions trip to Greece. Now, I don't know if I'm going for a week or two weeks. So, yeah, that's up to the Lord. But <laughs> either way, I am going. But my family also booked a Christmas cruise. My grandparents, um, we took them on a the cruise like... I want to say three years ago because I found out I was pregnant before I went on that cruise. And they were like, when are we going to go on another cruise? And my girl was like, we, we should go for Christmas. And so I found a Christmas cruise for us that was pretty affordable. And so we paid our $75 for of the deposit. So I pulled $75 out of there. But I'm going to put $40 in today. And then we've broken it down to what each person will pay. It's going to be six people, six people going in total. But my son, my three-year-old is not paying anything. So me and dad have to cover his, of course. But we plan to have it paid off by before we go on the cruise in December. So it's not too, too much. So vacation now has 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 240, 250, 255 dollars. Ooh, I hope I counted that right. I'll double check when I update my trackers, but y'all saw how I counted that 50. Y'all saw how I counted that. Let me know if I counted it right or not. <laughs> um, emergency is getting five dollars. Let's see. All right, so now our emergency fund has 1,100, 200. So 1,200 in the bank, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. $1,245 is in the in emergency fund. Uh, okay. And I did order some new placeholders. I'm so excited. Self-care is getting $20. And y'all, I had to pull out of self-care because I had a doctor's appointment and I did not have enough in my um, health singing fund to cover my copay, but it's fine. I mean, going to the doctor is self-care, right? It went well. So now self-care has $70 in it. Hubby is getting $5. A lot of categories are getting five. Um, just because my first paychecks of the month, I pay my car note. And if y'all know from like my previous <laughs> budget breakdowns, my car note is, it's, it's ridiculous. It is. But hubby now has um, $10. Avery is getting a five. So he has five, 10, $15. Health is getting $5. And as you can see, it's empty. Household is getting five as well. We have been pulling from this because I've been doing little things around the house. Household has five, 10, 15, 20, 25. Um, we, were gonna, we were going to do our son's bedroom over, but I just kind of like rejudged it a little bit. I took the closet doors off his closet and I put his dresser and laundry basket in there. And it's so, it's so cute. It gave his room so much more space. 
I moved his toy chest and we also had like a toy chest in the living room. I put that in his room. The only other thing that we need to do is convert his crib, that his crib converted into a toddler bed, but now I want to convert it into a full size bed. So the only thing I think we're going to do in there is paint, buy him a mattress and the bed rails to go to convert his crib into a full size bed. And then I think we'll be done with his room and we can move on to our room. <laughs> Colin is not getting anything. He still has 45. Holidays. About to say, did I put holidays on here? Holidays is getting five. Um, I'm so glad that I have this <laughs> envelope because I didn't like we Cinco de Mayo just passed, and I was like, are we gonna do anything for Cinco de Mayo? And like me and my friends are at an age where we're not really going out like downtown bars and stuff because we got kids, we got families, and we like to be in bed by 9 p.m. <laughs> so we end up having Cinco de Mayo at my house. So I, we pulled some meat out of the freezer. I went and got like chips and um, taco shells and some tequila. <laughs> and we just had something at the house and... I was able to pull the funds out of holidays for that. So this envelope has come in handy quite a lot, quite a lot. Um, gifts is getting five. We did go to a birthday party last weekend. And we got another one to go to next weekend. I don't know what we're going to do for them kids. <laughs> but that is it for our high priority second fund finder. And let's do our low priority sinking funds. This binder is still pretty new, so it's still stiff. Um, and again, I won't be stuffing this every time, but I want, I don't know, I kind of want to give it something every time, even if it's not a lot. So I'm giving most of the categories $2. <laughs> so date night is getting $2. And now it has $10, 20 $21, in there. So, I mean, it's growing. And then maybe once I finish some saving challenges, I'm able to move those funds over. Uh, lawn care is getting a 15. We did decide just to get our yard done once a month, which would be $60 a month versus bi-weekly because the grass does not grow super fast um, here versus our old house. So... If we need to change that, like in the coming months, then we'll adjust. Back to school is getting $2. I can't believe my son is about to be out of school for the summer. So now that he has 12. So I'm starting to think of like summer activities. His speech therapist is offering like a summer program. And I think that'll be amazing for him. So we just got to coordinate with his other therapist and come up with a schedule for the summer. Um, giving got $2, so now giving has $12. Um, and then water and sewage is getting $2. And I think this one now has $5, dollars 15 $16, $17. All right, and that is it for our low priority singing fund. And that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick um, cash stuffing. If you do, if you did enjoy, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. If you are not already, I would really appreciate it. And make sure you go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Bazador with two A's. I hope